Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay, I will. And here, since you're so cool, you guys are both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. Pretty damn similar. Huh? There's the number, but why two? Who knows? Come to think. <laughs> the reunion. There's nothing to fear. <laughs> Sephiroth is. Do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. Come on, let's go. What? <laughs> Alas, poor prince. I must confess I am not from this planet. Hey, Cloud! I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol, a lot of them tell me about their problems. Do you think you might be interested in helping out? Well, I'm all for it. We still have plenty of time. I'm on the clock. Don't worry, I give you permission. I always have the latest information. Come find me if you want to know. Lovely, don't you think? Great job. It's wonderful. <sighs> Isn't it? Oh, I nearly forgot. I saw some Shinra suit walking towards your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. <sighs> Don't take it personal.
<laughs> you Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. No need to get rough. Stay back. <laughs> No holding back. Can't you leave us alone? No. Stop it! I see you. you gotta get a little payback. Yeah. Come on then. <laughs> First class. Go on! Give it up! Get him! You're going down! I won't give up. Take a nap for me. Okay. Go on. Take that. <laughs> you can do it. My turn. Get him. Come You're on. You're going down. <laughs> now you're in for it. I'll take care of him. I won't <laughs> give up. <laughs> That's enough out here. I'm trying, but. Of all the times. I can't. Any last words? <laughs> okay then. <laughs> so, you had enough yet? No. I don't believe that I have. I can't believe you. You'll feel better in a second. Cloud's pretty strong, isn't he? Hmm. <laughs> I've seen this type before. You don't know me. Stop it! You're mine! I'm feeling pretty weak. How's that payback working out for you? Better than expected. I'll take care of you. I thought you didn't want to get rough. No, but this is self defense. Stay right there. You okay? Right. Get Here we go.
last long. After you. I'm coming. There. Good. <laughs> Do it. I'll show you what I can do. And catch! Stop it! Everything's spinning. Bundle up! Sorry, but My you turn. handle it. With that. Come on, you can do it. I'm waiting. I'll take care of you. <laughs> Get him. Why don't you take a nap? <laughs> I tried. I really did. Should have been there. Still in it. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> Time to get serious. You're out of luck. Please, just leave us alone. You know I can't do that. <clears throat> hey there, partner. Huh? I'm sure uh, you're having the time of your uh, life, but we're needed on standby uh, for a job. It's something uh, about Sector 7. So get your ass back here now. <sighs> Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? You're heading in already? Nah, not quite yet. You're heading in already? Yeah, that's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry, we got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? 
You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back. Good. Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? Uh. <sighs> I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl that could keep you on the straight and narrow, and tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. Don't want to overstay my welcome. What are you doing? Uh, uh, nothing. Did you have a bad dream? Don't worry, you'll feel much better in the morning. And I promise to take you straight home. Uh, okay. <sighs> Please don't let her hear me again. Jerk. I thought I told you. You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Look who it is. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. 
Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. <laughs> Lead on then. With pleasure. <laughs> Something wrong? It's nothing. <sighs> you can see the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time, but... And that's? The underside of Sector 6, Wall Market. A real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you? I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. And now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Want to see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid.